Hey, what's up, guys? It's Craig Syracuse of Walk of Faith. Happy Thursday. It is almost Thanksgiving. It's a week away when others fail us. The first time I was brought before the judge, no one came with me. Everyone abandoned me. But the Lord stood with me and gave me strength, and that's Timothy. In times of trouble, why are we sometimes forsaken by those we trust? Why don't our loved ones stand by us? There are many reasons that others fail us. Of course, they underestimate how the simple, loving support and prayers of the close companion can encourage the soul. However, even when it seems like everyone's walked out, you are never truly alone. Abandoned by his friends, the Apostle Paul was left to face his final court trial by himself. But the Lord took the opportunity to bless Paul with even a more powerful and profound experience of his presence. The same is true for you. God offers you peace and support just as he did to Paul. Even if all others leave, he remains faithful. Your Savior will never abandon you. So when you feel forsaken, draw to him and find all the strength, comfort, and friendship you need to make it through. Father, thank you for the peace I have in knowing you will never leave me or forsake me. Amen. In his presence, you are never alone. So this is a time in a sense of isolation where a lot of us are alone. You know, some of us have family and immediate friends, but some of us are alone, especially now with these new regulations for Thanksgiving. And I know sometimes friends and family can abandon you, right? And maybe not be there when you really need them the most. Or sometimes maybe they don't give you the advice or the affirmation or what you desire or what you need. You could always rely on Christ. And how you rely on him is by reading scripture and he reveals himself to you, to your spirit. And as you build that relationship, just like any friend, you could always go to Christ and just talk to him. Just before you go to sleep, before you wake up, when you wake up, when, whatever, you could always have a conversation with Christ and he will never abandon you. He will always be there even if you don't speak to him for years. This is the time where you really need to build a relationship with Christ. And it's very easy. It's just saying, God, enter my spirit or God, you know, I just want to talk to you about something. And you will see, especially through scripture, how his voice and how his spirit and everything will be revealed to you. And the way you do that is by reading the Bible and just building a relationship with Christ. Until next time, always remember you have the ability to inspire and evangelize through your words and actions. God bless.